It's the first of seven stops for the 2014 Red Bull Cliff Diving World Series, and it's the first time we've ever been in Havana, Cuba. A fascinating country rich in history and culture. The athletes are ready to face a new 27 metre challenge by diving from the legendary El Moro Castle, built in the 16th century. It's a new season, but everyone's chasing the 2013 reigning champion, Artem Silchenko. Being that it's the first stop, it takes some time to find their rhythm. Nonetheless, the stage is set for a battle to remember. On the main event day, in true Cuban style, the divers are paraded in a convoy of classic cars in front of thousands of eager spectators. Gary Hunt showed off a new dive which is nothing short of pure acrobatic brilliance, but his overall execution of the competition is left with some room for improvement. And the three times World Series champion finished in a respectable third place. And last year's series champion Artem Silchenko fell short of his own expectations by faulting on his arm stand blind entry to end up in seventh place. In the air, I fly really good, but I know it only underwater. I, I feel, I think what I fly too fast. I have somersault, fast rotation, and I do in the entry just safe. An unexpected duel for the number one position unfolded between Jonathan Paredes and Blake Aldridge. The Englishman suffering from a back injury mustered up all his strength and courage to perform one of the hardest dives of the competition. Then came Jonathan Paredes. A nervous wait for the results to see who will be the winner in Cuba. Yes! And it's Blake Aldridge taking his first ever win, a truly emotional moment in his career. I knew I had nothing to lose. Um, I just tried to come out today and, and dive well. I mean, I got two really bad ankles that are strapped up. I've had a really bad back for since last year. So to, um, oh man, just, I'm blown away, blown away. Havana, Cuba has been a great start to the season, providing us with an interesting and action-packed competition. But ladies and gentlemen, it's time to look forward to another inspiring tour stop at Fort Worth, Texas, USA on the 7th of June.